Dear Jack, I write you now with a heavy heart and troubled mind. What are you writing from? I'm sad. Peter. And I'm lonely. Why did you say that? My heart, it will Peter. For my sweetheart love what are you looking own. for? I wish I. Peter is a stinker, he smells like a wiener. He'll never have a girl because he'll never ever meet her. Take a warning. Take a warning Peter. from me. Oh, don't waste your affection on a Where young man you? so free. Because he'll have Peter. What are you and looking for? Tell you more lies than the cross ties on the railroad or the Peter is a stinker. He smells like wiener. He'll never have a girlfriend because he'll never ever meet her. What are you Peter? Peter. Red rose, but Peter. now they are white. Peter. And Peter, the are you Peter. That grows. Where are you? Peter, what are you doing? Peter, 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 Peter,
comes absolute confidence in something he is absolutely terrible at. Let's go. Thirdly, he decides to pick up a new hobby. I'm flowing, huh? And I'm flowing through that water. You can't see me. Elbow in the rim, Vince Carter. Then he tries to rebound with a new girl. Sometimes this stage gets skipped. My dick has to go throw up, so. Finally, he runs away, and I have to go pick him up before it gets dark out. Because Peter is terrified of being alone outside in the dark. No, I, I hope Jack doesn't find me. I mean, like, it's cool and all, like, we're friends, but, like, he's, he just gets really clingy sometimes, and, like, I, I don't know. I think I'm just better off out here. What are you doing? Reading. What you reading? A book. Huh? Hello, Blocky. How are you? What was that? Jack was talking about you? Were you being mean to Blocky, Jack? No. Were you? Oh, Blocky. I know he can be like that sometimes, can't he? <laughs> oh, it's okay. He still loves you. No. Yes, he does. He still loves you, Blocky. I know he does. fantasy and make-believe and it's good sometime to make real the world of fantasy and make-believe as some people do some people like like hobos for instance sometimes one sunny day in the month of May a burly bum came hiking down the shady lane by the sugar cane a looking for his liking as he strolled along he sang a song of the land of milk and honey where a bum can stay for many a day and he don't need any money oh the buzzing of the bees in the cigarette trees the soda water fountain the lemonade springs where the bluebird sings on the big rock candy mountain Okay, so Peter's either going to be over there on the benches or back at the playground. So if you want to check the playground, then I'm going to go check the benches, okay? Here, let me... Jack? 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 Jack?
How long has it been? Yeah. I'm so tall. So tall. It's been a day. It's been a day. Yeah, come on, so come on. That's enough. It's been a day. So what you're saying is you've actually missed no. me and we're best friends? No, that is not at all what I'm saying. Learn that I don't need to change. And it's not even the unbelievably talented, handsome playboy boy that I am, Jack. No, that's yeah. not what I'm saying. No? I was saying that you need to. That regardless of who I am, just to forget it and just rely on my absolutely talented good looks. Jack. Hey, slow down. Stop, man. Okay. Songs were sad during the Civil War. Some were kind of funny, humorous. There's one, there's a story about this. There's a fellow pulled up some weeds once and there's some little things on the roots. They turned out to be peanuts. Now the fellow that pulled up the weeds, his name was Mr. Goober. So they were known as Goober Peas. Shall we sing it? Yeah, let's do it. Sitting by the roadside on a summer's day, chatting with my messmates, passing time away, laying in the shadows underneath the trees. Goodness, how delicious eating goober peas. Peas, 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 eating goober peas. Goodness, how delicious eating goober peas. <laughs> my grandpa called them ground peas, I think. Yes. Yeah. Now, when a horseman passes, the soldiers have a rule to cry out at their loudest, hey, mister, here's your mule. But another pleasure enchantinger than these is wearing out your grinders, eating goober peas. Peas, 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 eating goober peas. Goodness, how delicious, eating goober peas. Just before the battle, the general hears a row. He said, the Yanks are coming. I hear their rifles now. He turned around in wonder, and what do you think he sees? He sees the Georgia militia eating goober peas. Right. Peas, 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 eating goober peas. Goodness, how delicious eating goober peas. Have your keys. Apartments have been, we do our best to live like the rest of you, but we're better, and that's the issue. Um, Just take a fucking seat. Uh, he -he. Hee 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 h